Okay, here we go. Here's the game. Okay, there it goes. Freaking cheese. Okay. Okay, so we've got a 2v2 this time. Uh, over on the left-hand side are the allies. We have a Riker playing as the Soviets, going for Soviet industry. And we have Blatz playing as the British. Then over on the right-hand side, we have the Axis. Nostrom playing Wehrmacht. And Isaac Killer playing Wehrmacht. And he has not moved yet. Okay, he, he, okay, he is building something. Okay, got it. So he is there, okay. I need to know how to frickin' pull up that chat on the left. Not that. I could... I don't frickin' remember. Infantry squad trained and ready any writer replays out there? I don't think I have any. Get ready, you lot. Order, sir. Right, okay, sandbag's going down. MG's getting set down here. And Penals will instantly have to retreat from the MG. Micro, if you're still there, do you know how to get the chat history up on that left hand side? Right there. I just I don't I don't know what the history is. I know it has something to do. With the frickin', uh, like, squiggly dash there, but I don't know what else is with it. Pull up that chat history. I can never frickin' remember. <laughs> really write it down somewhere, because I always forget. Our capture point. They're trying to take it. That frickers is not watching over that, uh, VP. Uh, as well as you would like. I'm just going to start trying to pick off some penals here. Gosh, I... I think the Reds are going to have an advantage on those penals. <laughs> nice cut off. Where's the MG in this? Oh, there it is. Bickers is not doing anything. And those grins are gonna stop those infantry sections quite quite efficiently. On the top we've got the penals still working on those on some grins here. I don't I don't know where this guy's going. But he's just getting eaten alive. <laughs> By those penals. Oh, we have a sniper! A sniper under our command! Yes, comrade. MG is trying- okay, Gren gets- What happened to all of the Grens? They're all dead! <laughs> I remember his Wehrmacht is actually pretty solid. The enemy is attempting to steal our sector. It's actually not great against OK. It's, it's actually just a sniper overall is just nice. It's especially nice against Wehrmacht because two shots are technically half its models gone already. <laughs> there are only four model squads, so the sniper is actually pretty efficient at that. Sniper on the run. 
Gotta love them snipers. So true. So true. Actually, might play today. Actually, no. I'm 100% gonna play today. Let me send out a ping. Joey? <laughs> Joey will probably play with me, 100%. <laughs> if he's up and around. Ooh, grenade? Oh, that was a good grenade. Just beautiful. Why are you even soft retreating? There you go. And Penal's back in business. Why? Oh, okay. We're already upgraded to PTRSs. I guess since you got the sniper, got plenty of anti infantry option here. Comes the P runs. Oh, all the grenade stuff was thrown there. Sniper 9. Oh, okay, there's a shot by the sniper. Beautiful hit, once again. Or you run away. Enemy forces are neutralizing a sector. You grab the cutoff here. I could be at work at 10 a.m. tomorrow. That is fair. We are ready for action. I mean, I gotta be at work at 11.45 tomorrow. What's your point, Joey? Grenade! <laughs> Does nothing. Mortar with a very nice hit. It's the cutoff done. Flamethrower coming in. The enemy is taking our territory. Now, since it's been so long since I've actually played, I'm well on stream, I should say. I will uh I will make it I will make it happen today. I'm in the mood. Oh, solid grenade. Victor 2 was built for the top. Oh, sorry, the bottom. Well, and the top, I guess, as well. <laughs> but, uh, it might be a bit late. That 222 is probably not going to be able to do too much of that T70. Okay, that shot did nothing. That shot also kind of did nothing. I don't know, T seventy. What the frick you doing? Two, two, two. You're not gonna win that, dude. I mean, I know you can pen it pretty decent, but heck no, you've got no chance on that. Careful with the grind there. Careful with the grind. Gets the kill. Friend does not get the Faust off because he doesn't have enough munitions! Oh no! <laughs> Prefer the 222 over the T70? Interesting. I do not feel that way at all. So true, Joey. So true. <laughs> but you know what? I gotta say, um, I prefer the tiger over the P4. I'll be, I'm just gonna put it out there. 
I know probably a controversial opinion, but I'm gonna put that out there. Can be a for late game for sure. Repair stations, okay. KT on top. Oh, so true, so true. Gotta love that KT. Player is out. Moment. Ooh, we've got good old Jaeger infantry doctrine. And then down on the bottom for blast, we've got commandos. And then Jaeger armor. Which is, um... Not exactly what I would expect. Because <laughs> it's a very, very, very good... 3v3 and 4v4 doctrine. But as a 2v2 doctrine, I feel it's a little weird. <laughs> AT over the T-70. You know what? That's... Mm, I'm gonna... Eh. I take sniper over everything. So true. Gotta love this sniper. Got to love the sniper. All the officers is gonna start eating up that pioneer. But uh, speaking of who's gonna be eating who, here comes the Grens. Oh my gosh, what mortar hits! <laughs> No, don't, don't soft retreat. Okay, yeah, good, good, go, go, go. Okay, 222 two, two died down here as well. No surprise there. Do these... I'm not even sure what killed it. Because the AEC is just recently out here. Plus one shell for target trainability. What? Does it shoot multiple shots? Oh, it shoots. Oh. Oh. See. Then once it hits vet one, it shoots twice. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I see. I see. Player is down. And you can snipe the units in the tanks. I feel like that would be a bit broken. <laughs> Picked. <laughs> we get another one. Ooh, the Grens! The Grens! They don't get it. They don't get it. The Jackson's open on the top. So what you're saying is they can only only the Axis snipers can pick allied vehicles. <laughs> is that what you're suggesting? The only thing you could snipe then for the Axis would be like the 221, the 223, and the 250 half track. <laughs> Satchel, very interesting move. Yeah, okay, I actually got two. I, I thought he would respond a bit quicker, but uh, he absolutely did not. <laughs> XLP, and don't forget about the SU-76. Yeah, that's true. They could, they could also pick the SU-76. As well, uh, along with the M5 half track, the scout car, uh, the UC. Actually, they could snipe the caddy too. Because you got that, because it's just open windows. Because it's just literally just like a car. <laughs> just got open windows, man. That's a dead grin. Up to the LMG. When an LMG is dropped by a Gren, and you have panels, so... Oh, it's terrifying. Yes. Absolutely the most terrifying unit you will ever see. See, look at that. Look at how open that is. You can snipe that then, technically, too. And you can snipe these trucks, then. 
three repair stations all in a very close proximity trying to pick the sniper sniper being up by himself is never a great time for the uh, sniper and that's gonna be snared AT gun is coming up to respond not the sniper sniper does die unfortunately yes along with the t70 good push by killer up here and he's firing on nothing oh wow okay there we go scatter is just really bad there's an mg over here well, all that wire is dead. Another truck onto the front. Vehicle ready to go. Emergency section just retreated. I don't care about the peace zoning. The sniper is dead. So true. He needs to remake it. Because otherwise, it's a joke. I could name, uh, very much whiffed. G42 causing suppression. Jaeger's trying to take... Take some advantage. It's just so sad playing Despacito. Esposito isn't even a sad song. <laughs> From what I can at least remember. How about the KV-8? What about the KV-8? He could make the KV-8, but we need the sniper again. Burn <laughs> them for the sniper. Yes. And then doubt KV-8. Oh, I see red smoke. That is some light artillery barrage. Here comes the AC. Trying to do something, and actually he's not going to get snared. Pack gun is going to try his freaking darndest. Smoke. And he goes. AC lining up his shot. Never mind, he started moving. Yeah, he's trying his freaking darndest. Oh man, what a shot. We have lost an MG team. One snare and it's done. It's dead. Where's the AC? We got a Stoog down here. Okay. I... I like never see anybody go down here. That's a pretty good spot for MG though. I have to keep that in mind. <laughs> this covers pretty much all this. And then here. Actually pretty good. Why don't you up on this platform? <laughs> okay, anyway. Uh, the bottom has been lost, so... That's not great. For the allies. Penals are just gonna... They're freaking winning this, I think. Yeah, Pegrins are dry. Oh my goodness, they wiped him. Now the next guy. Oh, they were trying to stall time, I think, I, I think for the uh, Grens. Dude, gosh, that, those mortars are having a grand old time. It's soon going to try to do a little bit here with its uh, pinto mounted machine gun that it has. Duke also has spotting scope, so that makes him even more terrifying. Mortar gets out of there. 
Cromwell's here. Put a command bunker there? Alright. He's a... Alright, so Nordstrom is very determined to hold the bottom here. Like, extremely determined. Here comes the Cromwell. Here comes the Cromwell. They're gonna get snared. Or not? The heck just happened? What? What? An SU-85 now on the top. And also a MG-42. <laughs> Near the cat. Oh, the caddy came down. I'm gonna kill the pack gun. Not gonna do it. The scatter was not in its favor there. You get two two models, but that's about all I was able to get out of that. And SU-85 is here. PTRS penals are not close enough. And the Panzer Force is going to run circles around that SU-85. The SU-85 just keeps missing. And there's the satchel. Well, at least the Panzer Four is going to die. But... Uh, at what cost is the question? We have a new Panzer IV. As he already has remade his Panzer IV. He's like, I will sacrifice my Panzer IV for that SU-85. Because of value. There we go, MG-42 is set back up again. Panzer 4 again. Uh, the only answer that freaking Riker has up here now is the PTRS panels. Which, uh, I don't think it's gonna be enough this time, though. Because it's not catching the Panzer 4 off guard. And now he's got no AT on the front to deal with that Panzer 4. The Panzer 4 doesn't know that. Uh, and there, there goes that, uh, command bunker. Yeah, there it goes. Commandos are running. Will they get wiped? No. No, they do not. Cromwell does some good work, though. And there's the double mortars doing work again. Wait. Where's the other one? Oh. Oh, sorry. That was light artillery barrage. I'm... Whoops. <laughs> Didn't even notice that. The Panzer Four sees you, dude. <laughs> He's like, hey, what do you think you're doing? I'm just gonna drive right on top of it. Because frick you. There, mine is now finished. I would laugh so hard if the Panzer Four now runs on top of it. Because I'm thinking he thinks that he didn't finish it. <laughs> oh, you can't make some of this stuff up, I tell you. What? Dude, you gotta learn, man. That's not the best idea. Okay, where's the Cromwell? Cromwell's busy. AT gun. He's dead again. <laughs> I'm not sure what he was going. Uh, he was probably looking for action the caddy. But, uh, yeah, no. 
It was down here. Which actually was kind of close to where the Pants 4 ended up being killed. The straps need me! Nope, we got, we got fucking the light artillery again. As Riker decides to walk straight into it, and the Gren picked up a PTRS. He, he did kill the Gren, which is probably for the better for Killer, because why do you have, why do you, why do you want a PTRS on that? Is that the worst thing in the world? <laughs> He's got a very small army compared to literally all the other players. Had he was looking for hits on that mortar, uh, hit, hit the MG that was retreating a little bit, but no wipe. I don't know why it said it twice. <laughs> Oh, but uh, the game just wanted... Okay, bounce, bounce. I was going to say, the Pack 40 is turning that 100% into the Panzer Force favor. I up here, this MG is just having a grand old time. <laughs> Another Panzer IV. When in doubt, more Panzer IVs. Yeah. Axis are gaining more fuel because currently the Allies are cut off to their fuel. So, the reason for that. Guy is having a rough time keeping his infantry alive. <laughs> okay, he's uh, he's got the vickers at least. Just a little bit more firepower, but much as not as much as you would like. Oh boy. Cromwell, no, 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 okay, maybe, maybe, maybe this is gonna help a lot. Six pounder, gonna back up. Oh, because technically they're set down. You have to disable it and then redo it. That's weird, actually. Actually, really weird. <laughs> Why you would have to do that? Hey, there's the KV-8, <laughs> and the Cromwell snared. That's bad. Hey, at least got the Panzer IV. The enemy have knocked out a Cromwell tank. Got him with his dying breath. This Panzer IV, I don't think, realizes that there's a six-pounder that's shooting at him. Dude, you aren't going to be able to really pen that. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> this one's for sure collecting. It's weird that this one's not, even though it's is in lockdown mode. And I thought this also kept it from being cut off. Or like, you still got the resources in the one area where you've got this then, like, it's not cut off. But like, this one would have still been. 
It was interesting. Maybe that was the Opal one. Specifically the Fairmock one, which would be stupid if it was only for one team. Ow. Reset them. They are locked down on a cutoff point. Ah, that's how it is. Got it. <laughs> Comes the actual good unit self to fight. Nice little light gammon bomb. We've got a caddy coming in. Just, just overall, just some general death. Well, for everybody, because the pants are petrified as well. And there's some white phosphorus going. Just, just some good stuff. Gosh, he's just going to keep making Panzer IVs, isn't he? He hasn't even upgraded to Battle Phase 3. I love it. Man after my own heart right there. Except I would not use the Jaeger Infantry Doctrine as my choice. I would choose something with spotting scopes. Then I can know how to avoid the AT guns. <laughs> we got Panther. All right. There's the other Panther four now. Panther four. So you're not gonna freaking. I mean, you can only pen the rear, and that's it. And even then, this is this is Mr. Reliable. There's Mr. Reliable. I'm penning the KVA. But uh, the KVA could just roast him, and then you're screwed after that. So. There's the Panther. I didn't scope, I think, only gives the range. Yeah, it gives, like, no other bonuses. It's just the range. Let's see. Show 100% for all vehicles. Plus 66% for the 250, and plus 40% for the 222. Okay, here they come! And the kv still gonna be in a terrible position there! And he's dead. Find time for the KV-2. And also the AT gun is now dead. Panther came up and honestly didn't have to do really anything. Here goes the MG. He's got to run off. And he's going to try repair killing the repair stations now, I think. Except uh, KV-2 is going to try to prevent a lot here. Got some flamethrower pioneers working on the AT gun. Panther's coming. KV2 gonna block the comets. <laughs> Big brain plays. Now KV2 is going for these guys. Like you know what? I'm turn. I'm changing teams. Oh gosh, there's two AT guns. Nope, nope, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. There you go. Keep going. Yep. Caddy is the answer. There you go. Yes. Yes. Also, there's a lot of barbed wire here. Also, uh, they were able to get out of there.
Yes, comrade. I hear the pants are very Where's the shooting? Where's the shooting? Where's the shooting? Steer. <laughs> that whole area. Warner going straight for the machine gun again. You got Mr. Plane flying overhead. Meow. Taking out everything. I think I hear the train. Yeah, that, that's gonna be the train run going by. Sorry about that, everybody. All right, let's see. All right, Panzer Force are moving in. He's finally got a battle phase three. He was thinking if he wanted to get that satchel off or not. You probably see my camera moving a little bit. That's that's going to be the train. I'm not sure what these P-Grands are doing. Ooh, big miss by the KV-2. U2's moving in. On what? I'm not sure. Wants to get murdered by the AT guns, maybe. Speaking of AT guns, three pack 40s. Gosh, they just absolutely obliterated that comment. Where's that caddy? That needs to be done. Okay, never mind. One creeping barrage. I think that. Oh no, it, it, he's just going over the barrage. He doesn't have a creeping barrage. Horrible scatter again. Wow. Got one model. This caddy has shot a lot, but has only gotten seven kills. Tiger Ace Mission Hard Stream. Gosh, that, is, that was one of the worst achievements ever to get. It's so much just save scumming for the penetration. Chances. It's awful. Absolutely terrible, but I have done it. It's a lot of sk save scumming. And artillery barrage again coming down. He really does like dropping that. This time it's not gonna do much. Other times it's been pretty darn effective, but that time it was not. Look at this beautiful caddy target. Move the caddy down to the bottom. Those are some beautiful targets down there. And smoke. That is. Oh, that's mortar cover. We got the white phosphorus starting to come down. Like not even hitting the road. That was um it wasn't great. That didn't do much of anything. It spread out so much. My pack guns are starting to move back in again. Yeah, the pants are very fur. Not gonna hit too much that time. And the caddy has moved down here. Good, that is gonna be needed. That is essential against this shit. <laughs> Look at all these penals. We have 
Oh, they're looking for the rifle grenade. Ooh, no. And here comes the two Panzer fours. I don't care how many PTRSs you have. Uh, you're gonna get absolutely destroyed. Yeah. That was a lot of dead penals. AV2 coming over to respond. Good hit. <laughs> oh, I thought they were gonna shoot the mine at first. No, but one found it. And AT gun is going to probably murder this one. There's one Panzer IV. There's the light artillery barrage again. And there goes the other Panzer IV. He finally makes a Panther. Like, he's, he's had some good darn use with that light artillery barrage. Like, it's been good. Even with the bounce, it does damage. Which is crazy. There we go, good hit by the AT gun. Good hit. SU-85 is coming as well. Trying to deal with the panther problem. No, finish off that panther. There you go. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. Those mines are just killing them. They're just so funny. Virgo's just killing lots of dudes. <laughs> oh, this guy's got an LMG. <laughs> I like it. So he walks into the arc. Keeps hitting the mines even though I just saw him replace them down. It's it's very funny. We have an elephant to deal with I guess the centaur and the comets. Because you know, I guess the pack guns are finally actually dying this time. Actually, been getting killed. Because uh, the caddy's actually over here. But even then, a Panther should be fine. Are you really having that many issues with, uh. Maybe there's another Vicar Street. Yeah, I don't know. I think so. Yeah, that's another Vickers. This got take aim. Went to KV2. Mines are down here again. Big shot and big miss. There you go. And... Gosh, he loves that light artillery barrage, doesn't he? Which is effective against the penals. Now the penal died, and so did the PK. Oh no, one PTRS. But that's gonna do so much against the KV-2. <laughs> oh, what a good hit. Panther's engine is still not repaired. That needs to be fixed. He's still got his two mortars. I mean, this one looks like it died at least. Uh, and got recruited. Well, I think so did the other one. This feels like an aggressive assault. Moving oh, these guys up so close. Why would you even use the Why would you even shoot an infantry with the elephant? Uh, 
out of pure curiosity. Oh, he was going for the mortars. Did he predict his movement? He did not. AB2 and SU-85 on the side here. Elephant does look like he's relatively prepared, kind of. Not really, actually. Because uh, he's not even shooting. That gun's going to instantly get picked up. Hopefully deal with that problem if it becomes more of a problem. Oh, pack gun's ready to go. Panther is pretty much dead. Ooh, KV2 does not. Uh, oh, the Panzer fair for probably swords. It was a Panther. And two SU-85s. One dude repairing. Yeah, that's that's not gonna take forever. Oh boy. Air supremacy operation. Oh, it's just here. Actually, the angle that it comes at might hit both of these two. Actually, it might hit the Panzer Fair for. Or not. Well, elephant's already dead. That got absolutely overwhelmed by tanks. Oh my gosh, no. Pack guns are trying their darndest. Panther's dead. And uh, pack guns no longer can see where they are. Uh, I think that's uh, that's going to be pretty much the end at this point. Allies have lots of tanks. Axis have done pretty much at this point. My throat's starting to go a little bit. So going to take a little drink. Our opponents are seizing a sector. There we go, and they're gonna do the cappy cap there. Jeez, that lighter. He does it again. And the bundle name was pretty decent, but uh, the pegrin died again. I'm very curious after this match. I am going to check how many P grants that man has lost. <laughs> uh, good hits on the mortars with the caddy there. Up to vet two now. Less scatter, which is absolutely super helpful. Two eighty five. I don't know what he's looking for. He's, uh, I, I'm not sure. In fact, I missed, otherwise, he probably would have gotten snared. Maybe two with huge misses. Oh, yeah, that three gives it extra health. Boom. Yeah. That was a huge whiff. <laughs> I like that it gets extra range though. Plus 25% range of fire. Oh my gosh, instantly just like... Shot right in the face.
just gonna let the KV-2 do its job. It'll do it well. <laughs> He's gonna go swing him up, up to the top now. Panther is getting remade back on the bottom. Other fire. Oh, the fire. Oh, yeah, because the firefly died. So he's remaking that. Any time left for your play. For your play. What play? Entar is trying a couple of those, but the pack guns are kind of lining up. Another Panther is being built up in the north now. They're probably going to make a couple Panthers and try to get one last push in. And he's firing. Creeper Barrage. Ooh, jeez. And that's a dead MG. Enemy has a gun. I don't think it has enough to creep all the way there, you know. Fans are fair for nothing there. Or you spend 30 munitions to have it actually just fire like a caddy. But the caddy can do it for free. Which is weird, but also I think it makes sense. <laughs> Axis have the better tanks. Allies have the uh, better artillery. Apparently, is how it goes. Oh, he's gonna get the snare off. He is, but um, those Panthers. I don't think it really go chasing. Yep, there goes one. You cannot go chasing because of those SU 85s. Especially now, now they're bet one. Which actually doesn't help that much. Bet two, it gets extra penetration. Oh, heck yeah. Okay, he's only got one mortar now. The other the other one's still here, decrewed, so it is an option for him, but I don't think he's gonna go for it. <laughs> There's the flak panzer. Things overhead, that's from Riker. Those Norse, Norse Roms is still on cooldown. Black Panther gets like one shot off on it. More <laughs> freaking. Let's do it again. Okay, here comes his buddy, his buddy's Panther. So it looks like they're probably gonna make a push down on the bottom. The enemy has 75 points remaining. CA5 and KV2. Trying to move down to the bottom. I think, um, I think something hit it, so we saw that this dude was down here. Yeah, 100%, because he's here. Or he just wanted to crush down here anyway, and he's like, hey, look, there's Panthers here. Which, uh, could very well be possible. They're going, they're going, they're going. Last ditch effort, last ditch effort. Panther's dead. Panther's dead. SU-85 was snared. He's backing out. Firefly getting good hits on the Panther. And, and Panther goes down. Panther goes down there. Comet's gonna go down for the Panther. And the Firefly is just gonna try to get the heck out of Dodge. 
On the MG42 is on the middle, or on the bottom VP, which has gotten the cap. A2 is very hurt. Like, extremely hurt. Gosh, got some good hits though. And KV2, I think, is gonna be okay. See, what's well, not there? SU85 has died though. That, that got destroyed. But KV2 was at least okay. Vet3 Jaeger Command Squad. Does not live. I thought he was going to. He does not. Centaur just opening up fire on those pioneers here. We are losing a sector. Infantry section died. We have Black Panther gets distracted by a plane. And then gets back into the air. That's the pack gun to back up the Flak Panzer. So bottom VP will still be controlled by the Axis, but they need more. Yeah, I'm not sure where the caddy's firing this time. Oh. Actually, it was aiming more this way, so I don't even know if you knew that it, that was there. The most 285s are back to deal with uh, the, the Flag Panzer, I guess. I think he was just thinking that they had more tanks. Uh, fun fact for you, they jumped. <laughs> also, there's the white phosphorus. There we go, this one's a lot better. And I'm just leaving a big gap in the middle. Fireflies! Hey, it looks like the Axis might actually grab the middle here, though. Back on this move in. There goes the P Gren. And there's the light artillery again. And we got a Panzer IV! I won't see that lasting very long. But the double SU 85s that are actually already coming. You can just set up shop here. Or like one here and one down here. Open the GG because they did lose the bottom as well now, so it does not matter that they were able to ride the middle. The bottom is done for. There's that creeping garage. Uh, I think the AT guns are back here somewhere, so that's maybe what it was going for on that. Bet 3KV2, uh, sadly it's not reload. Uh, I think it's turret rotation and uh, acceleration. Yeah, so it gets acceleration, more rotation speed on the turret, and actually an extra 160 hit points. <laughs> so we can take some more hits. I'll have time for one game. Alright. Sounds good, Joe man. The Joester, the Joe Meister. I don't, I don't know where I'm going with this. <laughs> the two forty, the four twenty. Should have been Joey G420. <laughs> Joey just blazing it up, you know, on stream. <laughs> if you guys don't know, Joey uh, is also streams, so you should check him out as well. All right, let's see. Riker with lots of damage, lots of kills. Blast with, a with actually a perfect one-to-one -one KD. 
then killer and nostrum also actually some pretty solid damage as well overall a very decent very solid game okay i gotta change my setup and then i will be back <laughs> 